Princess Anne's husband shares update amid her hospitalization after horse incident, recovering slowly. Hello viewers, welcome to Royal Unlock. Please make sure to subscribe and hit the notifications bell, so you don't miss any updates about the British monarchy. Vice Admiral Sir Timothy Lawrence gave a brief update on Princess Anne following her third night in hospital after being injured in a horse-related accident. Sir Tim, 69, answered some questions from the press outside the hospital on June 26 after visiting his wife. King Charles' sister, 73, suffered minor injuries and concussion after an accident at her Gatcom Park home on June 23. How is your wife, sir? Is she well? Someone called out to Sir Tim as he left the medical facility, as seen in a video shared with X by ITV's Chris Ship. I'm slowly recovering, thank you, he said as he headed towards the car. Are you expecting her out today, sir? asked another. She'll come out when she's ready, Sir Tim replied. Princess Anne's husband made similar comments about her condition after visiting hospital on June 25th. Sir Tim, who is married, said, she is recovering well, thank you. We are extremely grateful to the hospital's medical team and support staff for the specialist care they provided, and to the emergency services who were absolutely fantastic at the scene. Royal since 1992. He added, We are deeply touched by all the kind messages we have received from so many people near and far. It means a lot. In a clip shared online by ship on June 25, Sir Tim told reporters, She's fine. Slow but sure. On June 24, Buckingham Palace announced that Princess Sun had been hospitalized following an accident at her country home the previous day. The Princess Royal has suffered minor injuries and concussion following an incident in Gatcombe Park yesterday evening. Her Royal Highness remains at Southmead Hospital, Bristol, as a precautionary measure for observation and is expected to make a full and speedy recovery, he said in the statement. They continued, the King has been kept closely informed and joins the entire Royal family in sending his warmest love and wishes for a speedy recovery to the Princess. Due to the concussion the Princess Royal suffered, the exact details of the accident cannot be confirmed. However, Princess Anne's injuries are consistent with a possible impact from the horse's head or legs. The Princess Royal is an equestrian who competed on Team Great Britain at the 1976 Olympic Games. On June 25th, the Telegraph reported that Princess Anne was suffering from memory loss, believed to be temporary, in connection with the incident. The accident meant that the princess was unable to continue her schedule as planned this week. A palace spokesperson confirmed that she will not attend the Buckingham Palace banquet hosted by King Charles in honor of Japan's state visit on June 25th. Her plans to travel to Canada later in the week have also been cancelled, following medical advice. A palace spokesman said, Her Royal Highness sends her apologies to anyone who may feel upset or disappointed as a result. The King's sister is regularly cited as the most hard-working royal by the number of official engagements recorded in the court circular, making her absence from the front lines another blow to the royal family. King Charles resumed royal duties in late April after being diagnosed with cancer, while Kate Middleton continues to keep a low profile while undergoing chemotherapy. Palace Sades stressed that the Princess of Wales's recent appearance at Trooping the Colour on June 15, her first public event in nearly six months, did not signal a return to public royal work, as she continues to prioritise her health in private. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe. See you in our next video.